Well, the second trumpet doesn't get any better. They each actually get worse if you look at the magnitude. The second angel blows his trumpet. Something like a great mountain burning with fire was thrown into the sea. What is it? It's something like a great mountain burning with fire that's thrown into the sea. I mean, we can speculate, but what's interesting is that is exactly what an asteroid would look like coming into the earth. It would look like a mountain, and coming through the atmosphere, it would be burning with fire, only this one hits the sea. And look, look what happens. And a third, there's one of those fractions, of the sea became blood, and a third of the living creatures in the sea died, and a third of the ships were destroyed. We can go backward. Jane's naval, you know, Jane's fighting that does all the military stuff. In 2013, they say there's 177,000 registered, more than 100 gross weight tonnage vessels in the world. 177,000. Above that, there are 12,000 warships of all nations and flags. 166 nations have warships. So that's 189,000. Let's just say it's 200,000. 60 some thousand ships through tsunamis, through whatever, are just wiped off the planet. You know what that tells me? Don't go on cruises. You know, go on a mission trip on land, you know, but not really. But, because this is not the tribulation, but a third of the ships are gone. Can you imagine what's going to happen? All those iPhones being shipped from Shanghai don't get to us, you know, and everything else. It's going to be really bad. But it doesn't, then it says, a third of the living creatures in the sea died. Well, we feel pretty safe. We're on the land. The problem is the oceans cover how much of the surface? Over 70%. The most numerous plant creature is called phytoplankton. Phyto means plant, plankton means wanderer. It's a wandering plant that floats in 71% of the surface of the earth in the water. And those little factories make, depending on who you read, 55 to 85% of all the air and a third of them die instantly. It, not only the whales, not only everything else, you know, the porpoises and everything else, but the plankton and the algae and the brown and the rat, all of them, a third die. Now, we already have the smudge and the smoke coming in like it did in London in the houses. Now, the factories that were going to suck in that CO2 and blow out fresh air are dying. This is amazing what happens. Plus, he says that a third of the sea comes like blood. And so this, this whole fetid stench of death, a lifeless pallor on the water that were formerly teeming with life. What horrors as the God of the universe steps forward and through this plague says, I'm the God that made everything. I'm the only one that keeps you alive. Are you going to repent? Are you going to turn to me? So many lay gasping for air like fish out of the water, and they find God is a Savior, and many respond. And the multitude saved out of this mess show that God heeds the call that they call upon him.